I have uh, greatly admired the development of OTS through the years. I'm proud and relieved to be um, a um, survivor this long. And um, I guess 75th anniversary, forget it, this is my last salute to you. And I just wanted to say one final important thing to you. You must understand it. Most of you will realize it, I think. This is your century. And by that I mean not that just that OTS will continue to flourish, to have global influence, but also this is, the rest of the century is going to be the century of biology. And we know all about well, the great things that molecular biology is accomplishing and developmental biology. But we've also noticed, I hope you've noticed with me, that in the environment movement, the attention has shifted primarily to the physical environment, pollution, resource, um, natural resource exhaustion, climate change, and all of that. And our attention of the world has fallen off a lot from the living environment. That's got to change. We have to start paying attention to the living world that we are totally dependent upon. And I think it's easy to predict that there will be a shift back, at least an evening out of attention and support to exploring the living world. We know approximately 1.9 million species now of all kinds of organisms, uh, from African elephants and blue whales all the way down uh, to the little picozoans that have been recently described, too small to be seen by ordinary light microscopy. Uh, we've only begun to explore it. 1.9 million species are known. The actual number is going to go into the, uh, into the many millions, perhaps 4 million, 5 million, 6 million, especially when we start getting to these very small organization, organisms. And what better place than OTS to begin exploring, resume seriously with a goal in mind, a finishing time, or at least a, a time when we reach 80% of the goal and 90% of the goal, what better place uh, to have as a headquarters for this kind of search to go on than biodiversity-rich uh, properties of uh, OTS and, and, and those attended to and researched by OTS people and OTS-affiliated scientists around the world. Um, in addition, of course, uh, there remain in front of us not just to explore the world, with scientific natural history, the opportunities of which abound, I'm certain, with La Selva and most kinds of organisms as they abounded for Bert Holdobler and myself at that first trip uh, down to La Selva. Uh, but in addition, we have before us the great task of understanding how ecosystems are put together, what keeps them stable, what they mean in terms of basic biology but also in terms vitally of uh, human survival and quality of life. You are assigned that job. If you don't have enough money now, and you certainly don't, it's inevitable uh, that the attention of the world will shift in your favor. And OTS is the organization to keep strong, uh, to develop with what you can what resources you can put into it, and be ready when the call is made. Thank you so much for having me here, at least like this.